Okay, let's quickly do the attendance. So, Abdullah Kajim. Yeah. <laughs> Say yes. Abdullah Sayyid. Yes. Okay, Abdul Rahman. Yes. Abdul Wahab. Yes. Ali. Not yet. Yes. Amma. Yes. yes. Fahad. Yes. yes. Faisal. Yes. yes. Hamad. No. Khalid Abdullah. No. Khalid Mohammed. Mohammed. Yes. Mubarak. Yes. yes. Nasa. Yes. yes. Talal. Yes. Yes. Excellent stuff. Okay. Right. Good afternoon. How is everybody? Everybody's doing okay? Right. So, we are going to continue on from where we left off previously. This is our title for today's class, Boats for Beginners. We all know boats. Do boats, uh, are boats on land, in the sky, or on water? Water. Good. And beginners, does this mean that I am an expert and I know everything? No, new. Beginners means I am new. So obviously you are new to learning about military boats, but have you ever been on a boat before? Yeah. Any boat? Yeah? Big boat or small boat? Big boat. Small boat. Small boat? Okay, and what did you do on the boat? Oh, I told you, you were base surfing. Oh, excellent. Oh, there you go, that's it. And somebody said big boat. Is that you, Mohammed? What did you do on the big boat? Fishing. Go fishing? Just relaxing? Yes. That's it. Have you been on the Dow boats in the Corniche? Has anyone done it? I guess obviously because you are from here, it's maybe not for you, it's for tourists like me. But have you ever done this with the music? Yeah. yeah. Have you ever had a disco, barbecue, things like this? Yeah. These are quite fun. If you go to this bad song here, take my phone, plug this in. <laughs> That's it. You can get some great songs in here. So hopefully these are our class objectives. By the end of today, we will be able to do this. We're going to describe and define. So describing means to talk about and defining means to give more detail. We're going to be talking about naval terms, which we have already done before. And you're going to be able to give some directions while on board a boat. Do I use left and right while on a naval boat? Yes. Yeah. Do I use front and back while on a naval boat? boat? So. Good. Do any of you remember some of the vocabulary that we used this week? For instance, what do I call the back of a cruiser? Who said that? Good man, that's exactly right. Let me pick a nice color, I'm going to use blue. Yes, we call it a stern. Do you remember the back of the boat? I don't say back of the boat, I would say stern. Exactly right. What do I call the front of the boat? That's it. Do we know how to spell it? B-O-W. We call that the bow of the boat. Right. Do we remember, we only did this very briefly, what we call the left and the right of the boat? Yep. Yeah. Well, when it's night time and I look up, you know, you can't do that here. Well, then maybe we can try. When it's night time and I look up, what can I see in the sky? The moon. moon. The moon. And what are those? Star. Star. Stars. That's it. So it's called star. I need money to check out the star. This one. Starboard. That one is for the left or the right? Oh, left. Very good. Well done. And what do I call the right? Do you remember that one? Not, uh, Oh, yes, we do. We call it port. Lovely. Okay, good. So these are some of the words that we have been picking up from this one. And then the carrier itself. Is the carrier, does it go up and down or is it flat? Yeah, flat. And what do I call that? Uh, that's a more technical term, but just the actual name for the entire thing. Um, uh, the, uh, that's the size of it. That one I'll probably have to give you that one because we didn't touch on it briefly, but you're right to talk about